This is Coach Ferris. And this is Sam Arbudet. Welcome to Ram TV. One. Welcome back, Rams. I'm Selena. And I'm Nathan. This week has been pretty crazy with finals and everything, but I'm excited about Spirit Week, though. It kind of takes my mind off all these tests. How's finals been going for you, Selena? So far, so good. It's kind of stressful, but luckily there's the dance to look forward to at the end of the week. And just a reminder for everyone, the Silas Snowball will be held this Friday the 3rd from 8 to 10 p.m. in the gym. Tickets cost $5 for people with ASB and $35 without. Tickets will be available in Mrs. McFarland's office until February 2nd. We hope to see you there celebrating end of semester. Now let's start off with Maddie, who has our four-day weather forecast. One. Good morning, Rams. I'm Maddie, and I'm here with your weekly Ram weather. Did you know a mudslide can carry rocks, trees, vehicles, and entire buildings? Now it's time for our four-day weather forecast. Thursday is looking to have showers with a high 47 and a low 38. Friday is looking to have showers with a high 48 and a low 40. Saturday will look rainy with a high 50 and a low 41. And finally, Sunday will have rain with a high 50 and a low 41. That's all I have for this week. Now back to you. Thanks, Maddie. Now here's some imp important information with Ram Sports with Sonia. Hey Rams, it's Sonia coming back with your weekly Silas Sports. This past week, the boys basketball team fought in their last home game against Mount Tahoma and won 70 to 65. The girls also took on Mount Tahoma and took the win 34 to 29. If you're interested in next session sports, they include boys soccer, boys baseball, girls tennis, softball, and track. That's it for this week. Now back to you. Thanks, Sonia. Up next, we have some important information from the yearbook team. Seniors, this is the last week to add a senior portrait. Submit to yearbookforever.com. Access code RAMS, all lowercase. Thanks. Once again, Nadia has some great top five picks for us. Nadia? Hey Rams, no matter wherever you are, hamburgers are the most famous meal for either lunch or dinner. Today we're going to be counting down for our picks of top five hamburger places in Tatoma. Number five is Red Robin. What could be better than a rich hamburger with unlimited fries? Red Robin is famous for their hamburgers as well as their perfect sized fries, which makes their food ultimately awesome. A number four is Five Guys. They make fresh hamburgers and they have a variety of shades. Number three is Shake Shake Shake. They're famous for their loaded, fr loaded hamburgers and variety of shades and smoothies of many flavors. The interior gives you old school diner vibes. Number two is Frudrels. It's an old school drive through which is famous for their classic hamburgers and shades. And number one is Fristo Freeze. It is one of the Tatoma's most famous burger joints, having served burgers and shades since 1950. It has an old school vibe and is good for an easy meal. If you're in the mood for low trust friendly and fast food, you have the option to drive up to the order window, then park and wait for your food. That's all for this week. Now back to you. Thanks, Nadia. This week we have some exciting new esports information. Let's see what they have for us. Attention Silas students, if you have not heard already, Silas kicked off their very first season in esports. It was a very successful season with the Rams finishing second in the tournament. Way to go Rams! The sign up for the next session is happening now. Come to the informational meeting on February 7th at 210 in room 409. The sports that will be played this session are Overwatch 2, Rocket League, and Chess. These sports will only be played if there is enough interest. Again, the informational meeting is in room 409 on February 7th. Hey Rams, don't forget to attend the Snowball, hosted by your junior class on February 3rd from 8 to 10 p.m. in the gym. If you want to bring a guest, forms are available in Mrs. McFarland's and the main office. Return your forms by January 27th. To see if your guest got approved, there will be a list posted outside of Mrs. McFarland's office, which can take up to two days after turning it in. And remember, if you have an ASB membership, tickets will only cost you $5. If you do not have an ASB, the ticket is 35 and includes an ASB membership. You can also check with Mrs. McFarland to see if you qualify for free and reduced lunch, which can reduce the $35 ticket price to only $5. Bye, Rams. Now back to you. That's all we have for you this week. Until next time, great to be a Ram. Ram.